G'day guys and girls, how you going? It's your boy Jable 1990 welcome to a brand new mod showcase. So here you going guys, today we are reviewing the Mo Cows mod. If any of you guys haven't heard of that, it's because it's pretty much brand new, it was, I think it was only released a couple of weeks ago maybe, maybe even, not even that long ago. Um, now what this does is this is going to add 16 different new types of cows into Minecraft. It's actually pretty cool. Um, so. The 16 different types, um, they spawn in natural biomes, so you guys don't need spawn eggs for this. I'm just using spawn eggs because I'm in creative and I'm doing a tutorials for tutorial purposes. Um, so they will spawn in different biomes, for example, one will spawn in like caves where there's stone. The other one will spawn in plains biomes like this, the other will spawn in jungle, etc, etc. So if you want any more information on that, if you're interested in that, just check the description. The download link to this mod will be there as well, so let's get right on into this. So the very first one. We're going to want to grab some armor too because these things are dangerous, some of them, anyway. So we're going to load up with armor. This one is the mill tank. This is the very first brand new cow in Minecraft. It looks pretty much exactly like default. That's because it virtually is, except it's different color. Now the reason for this is because it's a normal generic cow, except the difference is with all of these new um, cows, they all move two times faster than a normal regular cow. So they kind of always have a natural speed speed boost. Now the difference between this and a normal cow is when you kill it, instead of dropping beef, it will drop a raw pork chop. So it actually drops pork rather than um, than beef, which is actually quite disturbing when you think about it. <laughs> but that's pretty much, oh let's go into game mode, game mode uh, zero. That's pretty much it. The second one, oh god, this is, this is a creepy one, because this one is the creeper cow. As you can see, these um, this one obviously is going to be hostile, and he has like the little creeper face action going on here. Um, now he acts just like a creeper, uh, but apparently it says on the on the actual. Wow, he didn't even hiss or nothing there. Wait, that might be my bad. Yeah, there we go. And let's turn on friendly just because. Uh, they actually explode. It says on the forums that they do twice, two times explosion damage, which I don't know if that means. Um, you know, two times more than a creeper, but it doesn't really look like it. It looks like standard to me. But, um, yeah, those guys, you definitely don't want one of those guys creeping up on you. Now, this guy, the, this, the uh, fish cow, <laughs> you'd think this one would be pretty cool. But this, something, this looks like something fresh out of Adventure Time or something. It is a hostile cow, and it is actually extremely fast. This thing will catch you, and even with diamond armor on, will do half a heart's damage every single time it hits you. Without armor, I don't even want to know. Should we test it? Should we test it? Let's test it. Oh god, he does a lot of damage with without any armor on. This is going to be hard, guys. Let's put all this back on. He's going to come kill us. We've got to try to kill this guy. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me, Mr. Fish Cow. No! <laughs> Oh god, we're in a bit of trouble here guys. So when you kill this cow, it actually drops you a cooked fish. You would think it would be raw, but no, it is cooked. So let's go into game mode one real quick. Grab ourselves some food because we actually need it. Let's just grab ourselves some golden apples because God knows we're going to need it. <laughs> that that cow was insane. So that's the fish cow, guys. The next one is the skeleton cow. Now, the only unfortunate thing is I have to set it to uh, time set night because uh, just like normal skeletons in Minecraft, these guys will actually... Um, <clears throat> these guys will actually burn up in the daytime so that's a little bit unfortunate so if, let's let's just light this place up a little bit so I can show you guys now this is the skeleton cow obviously gonna be hostile moves quite slow actually very slow um, they are hostile so they will try to hurt you I was expecting maybe something a little bit more interesting like the cows actually shoot arrows don't ask me how but you know it's just the, the basic um, thought process of Minecraft. So that's the skeleton cow. Drops you bones, of course, every single time you kill it. Pretty interesting. Next one is the Herobrine cow. Now this one is actually scary as hell. Look at him. He looks like a standard Minecraft cow except with those white Herobrine eyes and he will try to kill you. So he's like extremely OP. But that's really loud. It plays that cool little animation after you kill him, and he will drop you one golden apple. Did I pick it up? I think I did. So the um, 
the the risk is definitely worth it to be able to give yourself a golden apple. Next one is the Terminator cow. This one looks pretty beastly. He's got like all this uh, metal armor and like metal eyes and stuff. Let's just get back here and have a look at him. There he goes. He's got like this cool green eye and like this metal face and stuff. It looks pretty sweet. Now the cool thing about this guy is if you ever see him out in the wild, he's gonna give you one diamond. That's pretty epic if you ask me. Next one is which one is this this is the apple cow this has actually been featured in like a few different mod packs like um crazy craft and things like that but the only difference is these guys are hostile and they want to kill you look at this like they want to make your teeth better and you and improve your health by giving you healthy food but at the same time they want to try to kill you so just be careful about those guys next one is the birthday cow who is also hostile i don't really know why I don't know if he's like angry it's your birthday or if it's his birthday and you forgot. He's like, it's my birthday, bitch. You forgot. <laughs> but the cool thing about this guy is when you kill him, he will drop you a birthday cake. Let's put it on top of our chest. There we go. Look at that. Awesome. So let's um, actually set time because I don't know how well you guys can see. Time set. Day. Pretty awesome, right? Now, the next one is the blue cow. This guy is actually friendly. Um, he pretty much looks like the standard default cow except blue with black eyes. Uh, he won't hurt you, even if you do, like, I can hear zombies. Get away! You're ruining my video. Even if you do, like, give him a little love tap, they will just try to run away from you like standard cows. Now, when these guys, um, die, they will give you an ender pearl, which I think is pretty damn sweet. Pretty good reward, if you ask me. And Flesh, get out of here. No one wants you here. Now, the next one, actually, is pretty interesting. This is another hostile cow, and it looks pretty derpy. <laughs> Look at the thing. This is called a buffalo, which is a different. I don't know. If, I don't know if it's actually a form of like from part of the family tree of a cow, but uh, pretty weird looking. And when they die, they just give you a standard piece of leather. So you actually get more from a normal cow than you do the buffalo. Next one is the candy cow, who's also hostile. Don't don't ask me why. It might be a bug that the developer has to fix. But these happy cows seem to want to kill you. So the candy cow, when you kill him, he will drop you one piece of sugar. I don't know if you might want to make a speed pose or anything like that. The next one is the Klaus Cow, which is actually really, really passive. It won't hurt you at all. Moves really slow. He's like, a, he's like a groovy hippie cow. Now, the cool thing about this is that when he dies, he will drop you a feather. Kind of like another alternative to chickens if you're trying to make yourself some arrows and whatnot. Pretty cool. Now, the next one is the Ice Cream Cow, which, again, is hostile. I don't know what it is about, like, all these awesome cows, like, party cows and stuff being hostile. Ow. But, um... This ice cream cow, he looks like the Neapolitan cow, like the new, you know, the Neapolitan ice cream. He looks like the Neapolitan ice cream. So the cool thing about this guy, though, is when you kill him, he'll give you one cookie. How cool is that? I think that's pretty worth it. Like, come at me, ice cream. Now, this cow has to be my favorite cow, and you'll see why. He will teleport away as soon as we put him in. It's the Enderman cow. Ready, guys? Be ready to pause the video to check him out. There he is. That's the Enderman cow. You can actually hear what he says. He will be turned into hostile like a normal Enderman when you kill him. And he just looks pretty beastly. Drops an Ender Pearl, kind of just like the other cow. Uh, pretty awesome, if you ask me. Second last cow is the Flying Mushroom Cow. Now, quite a random cow. If you look at it at first, it makes like the Ender Dragon sound effects. It will shoot a couple of fireballs at you. And then if you hit it once, it's going to like... Oh, I did it before. If you, if you actually hit this thing up into the air... It actually flies up, like floats up kind of thing. It has like this floating animation, but he kind of acts like an Enderman slash Ender Dragon who would give you a mushroom stew upon death. That seed was not a part of it. That was just from me <laughs> hitting that grass. So guys, the final cow is called the Mill Tank, which again is hostile. And I don't know if this guy just made this as a goof or if he was a big Pokemon fan, but it looks like he's made this to look to mimic the um, Mill Tank from Pokemon, which looks actually pretty weird if you ask me. Oh, get away. And when you kill these th little mill tanks, they will give you one piece of wheat. So there you guys have it. That's everything on the Mo Cows mod. Pretty interesting. 16 brand new different cows in Minecraft. It's definitely worth checking out. The download link is in the description. Also, a link to the forum page. It's the same link if you guys want to check it out. Any info or any trouble installing, it actually has a guide on how to install it and all that good stuff. But uh, yes, the Herobrine cow and the Skeleton cow couldn't make it here this afternoon because they like to teleport and die in the sun. Anyway guys, that's going to do it for my time. Be sure to like this video, give it a friendly like rating if you enjoyed or if this mod showcase helped. Uh, it really does let me know that you guys enjoy these videos. If you're new to my channel, be sure to subscribe because I do like to do these mod showcase videos every single Saturday. And uh, yeah, these cows, are, these cows are pretty awesome. Look at the Terminator cow just eyeing me off. Come with me if you want to live. 
<laughs> anyway guys i really do hope you hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you could like i said it's always appreciated if you guys leave a like other than that guys that's gonna do it for me have a good one and i'll see you guys next time